In this Express tutorial, we're going to show you how MBC routes work. First, we're going to show you the version in which this MBC solution is based on. Then, we will display a working route. Then after, we will try to receive a text value into a parameter. Then we will show you the first solution for receiving a text value as a parameter. Then we will show you a second solution, which is a much more better practice. And finally, we will show you an action that will accept several parameters. So before we start this uh, Express tutorial, I'm going to show you some versions in the si inside the solution. And the first one, the system core, and we're looking at version 4.0.3. On MBC, we're looking at the same version numbers, 4.0.3. And for Razor, we're looking at 4.0.3. First, we're going to demonstrate the default route that everyone is familiar with. As we can see from the debugger, the numeric value comes through. Now we're going to show what programmers attempt to do when trying to receive text values in an action. In this example, the name value is Charlie. We're going to hit enter and we're going to go to the debugger and we'll see that the name comes out as null. In MBC you can receive text values using the ID as the parameter name. Once again, in this case, Charlie is the name parameter and in this case we're using ID and as you can see Charlie comes through so the easiest approach is to leave the parameter name the same and change the data type now if you want to follow good practices in programming by using parameters with names that describe their use you will need to change the route the cleanest way to change a route is to use map MBC attribute routes by changing the route config. We add the following code. We save it. And then we add a new action. In this case, we are decorating the action with the route to accept a parameter called name. And now, what we're going to do is we're going to test this. We will run the program. We will input the link. Once again, the value is Charlie. We'll hit enter. As we can see, the parameter name called name accepts the incoming value. Finally, we can see how this approach can be used to accept several parameters inside the action. In this example, we still use the name Charlie, but now we're attaching state and country. The debugger shows that the name came fine as Charlie, the state came as New York, and the country is United States. This concludes our Express tutorial. If you want to take advantage of more Express tutorials, please subscribe to my YouTube channel below.